everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to another Waterfall of the Wild. Now, I need to keep my head down just now. Starting off, as usual, in the lodge. And having a look at some of my new trophies. Starting off with this corner. And let's get investigating mode. We've got this piebald reindeer. Um, I got that yesterday actually, yeah. First rare reindeer that I've ever had. And then a Sika albino. First rare al um, Sika deer as well. And then albino red deer. Which I got, I got that on Teobaroa. Not, well, when was that? 6th of February, no, okay, yeah, a couple of days apart. And then, yesterday as well, I got this, my first diamond copper tailie. I was actually on a moose hunt when I spotted that one. And over here, we've also got another melanistic moose. Only a small one. And then, what else did I get? Um, I need to keep my head down because, oh yeah, got this here. Piebald Lynx, which is that one there, and it was a troll. It was 0 0.04 away from being a diamond. I was rather annoyed with that one. And this albino female, which I got yesterday as well. So I've been on a bit of a lynx hunt. Um, you'll see another lynx that I've got. Still keeping up. Oh, I just spoiled something there. In here. I've got up there, like that. This is going to be my troll room. i got this other lynx, which was 0.14 away from being a diamond. I got that on the exact same hunt as I got the piebald one. And then I also got this grey wolf. can't remember what diamond score for it is, but it wasn't that far away from it. So now, oh, there's another. I shall show you a clip.
and here is that diamond roe deer I got. First diamond roe deer is 83.7. Not a very big one, but I'm happy with it. And then also got this fallow deer, I think it's this one here. Smallest fallow deer. So what have we got? 264, 262, 263. Yeah, I think it was that one there. And so I did a few weeks ago actually get another diamond fallow deer on Te Avaroa. This one I got on Hirschfelden. I was trying to do the mission where you've got to get a photograph of a fallow deer with a lake in the background. And I was waiting for a deer to come out and this one popped out. Which I was rather surprised with. And then here's the diamond lynx. Got that on the exact same hunt as I got the other two lynx. What score was he again? 28.1 And then my second ever diamond moose. The other diamond moose I got before I got the lodges uh, pack. So I was rather happy with this one. Um, so my lodge is starting to fill up a bit. And speaking of lodges, oh yeah, I got this. Was it this one? I don't know if I showed that in the last video. I also got this piebald fallow deer. And right after I got this, I got the other piebald, not the other piebald, um, my other diamond fallow deer. But I forgot to taxidermize it. Which was rather stupid of me. Um, so yeah, lodge is getting filled up pretty quick. Uh, and what I'm going to do just now as well is we shall take a look at the new free lodge. <laughs> what have we got with this new power pack or whatever? Showcase update. Now I'll give my views on it. Beautiful view that. So here we are. Start off on. Now, I don't know what is going on, but I don't know if you can see, but it looks like water going through. And there's a couple of things I'll point out in the lodge, but stunning lodge. But I think, I mean, it's, it's a good lodge to, for beginners. I know it only holds the animals on first two base maps, Hirschfeld and, and Leighton. And I can see where they're go going with it. Um, it's a beautiful lodge. I would actually love to live in here. <laughs> um, I don't know if I'll be using it. If they did a lodge like this for every animal in the game. So you can only put, for instance, you can only put a fallow deer there, red deer there, roe deer there. They did that for all the animals in the game. I think this would be a great lodge. I mean, it is a st stunning lodge. And hopefully this is a hint to what's going to be coming in the future European mounts.
and also as um, I think it was Jaxi said on the stream if we could get a way of putting our own photographs and screenshots in there then that would make it a lot better as well a couple of things now which one was it I did notice um, for all the amount of bedrooms so that's one room there there's only one shower and one bath for all the bedrooms that's two bedrooms up here we got in here? Another bedroom. It's three bedrooms. So this was this would be the ensuite. But there's no shower or bath in it. And this roof roof is rather low from the, the toilet. And was in here I mean, it's sorted now there was a bit of a graphics glitch with that rug it was showing different colours and what was the other bit I was going to look at yeah down here I mean it is a good looking lodge but you can they could put some more trophies plaques around the place. I'd stop running. I reckon. <coughs> What's in here? Well, there's another bedroom. So it's one, two, three, four bedrooms. And was there another bedroom down here? One bath and one shower for four bedrooms that's outside yeah they could do they could put another couple of plaques up here and there there's plenty of room like these plaques here they could have made them so that you can put whatever you want on there I think if they did this where you can put you can only put certain trophies on certain plaques for each map that would be great as well <coughs> and I don't know if anybody else has noticed that we've got a basement as well and there was a bit of a graphics glitch Looks like it might have sort of, oh no no, you can just see It looks like water coming through And we can't play pool, unfortunately So you can fit a few plaques on these walls Even put one up there, that fire sounds nice Right, you can see, looks like there's smoke or water coming through. Just minor detail. It doesn't ruin it. But what we got here? Spirit. <laughs> a sprite. But yeah, they could have put some more plaques up. Got rid of some of these pictures. And given us a couple more plaques. But that's just, that's just my view. What's out here? Is this the back door? No, you can't even use that door. Yeah, stunning view. As I said, I would love to live in a place like this. Can you get in this door? Nope. And a lovely lodge as well. But as I say, it's only for the first two base maps. 
first building and Leighton Lake for beginner players. Good lodge to start off trophy collection in. hear that sound glitch. Sort of like metallic buzzing noise. It happens to me when, um, when I've got like herds of animals around me. Navigator or crocodile. But yeah, that's the new. Yeah, when doors open like that. That's the new lodge, trophy lodge. Very nice. As I say, I don't know if I'll be using it. Maybe if we get great ones of each of these. And then we've got the moose, red deer. White tailed deer, great ones, and the black bear. So, if we get great ones, well, people are, are speculating that we're getting European bison great one, whether it comes to or not, I don't know. Um, I would rather have the fallow deer great one myself. But yeah, if they do great ones for each of these species, then. It'd be a good lot to show off the great ones. I don't know if they do a great one mallard or turkey or goose or coyote or red fox. Is there no rabbit one? Oh yeah. Jack rabbit and European rabbit down there. But yeah, that's my views on this lodge. It is very nice done. Good idea for beginner players that don't have all the maps or the trophy lodge pack. And if they do it for each of the maps then that would be good. Or a lodge, a big main lodge with plaques for every species like they're doing here. So you can only place certain trophies and certain plaques and plinths. But yeah. So. Let's have a look see what it's like at night actually. And let's go to... Half twelve. For a minute there, I thought it was snowing in the picture. <laughs> Very cosy looking. Looks great outside in the dark. Yeah, that'll be it all for this video. If you enjoyed it, then please, as always, leave a like subscribe if you're new around here and want to see more. Um, I've not been uploading much recently because I've been working hard and after I finish work I get like an hour playtime and then have my tea, relax, go to bed. So I'll try and upload as much as I can over the next wee while. Um, as I've just recently started the game over, I've not been getting that many trophies. I've been getting a few, but once I start getting more and more diamonds and that, I'll start re actually recording hunts and whatnot. So yeah, as I said, if you enjoyed this video then please leave a like, subscribe, comment, give me suggestions of what you want to see. And shall see you in the next one. Take it easy, everybody. Have a glass of wine. 
play cards. 